If you're saying God is so good, like, why would he allow, like, all this bad stuff to go on? Like, there's so much bad stuff. Like Not the same question, bro. Over and over and over again, bro. Same question, bro. Same question every single time. You have 20,000 videos of the same topic. With tons and tons and tons of explanations and the people still don't get it bro they come up to these meetings and ask the same dumb questions and i'm sorry i get it there are people that you know they don't look that up they just ask the questions out of the blue you know they probably don't not come in prepared but just out of logic you have to think that that question bro <sighs> Like, well, raised, like kids with cancer, like people dying. Like, why would a good God allow all of this to go on? Like, how do you explain that? Oh. Spoiler alert free will. Free will. Free will, bro. Ultimately, I do not know why God allowed evil and suffering. But I free do will. Know how do you don't know, Cliff? How do you don't know, Cliff? Oh, okay, okay. He us hey, hey. He knows, he knows why they didn't, okay. Love him. And love in order to okay. be real must be free. If it's not free, it's not love. In other words, I'm convinced a computer and a robot cannot love. But you can, I can, yeah. because we're human beings created with a free will. And anyone is entitled to have their own opinions have their own way to live their life, have their own actions, have their own whatever. That's it. <laughs> so, why is there evil? Because people choose to do evil. But God did not create evil. God created us with free will. Right? I think y'all are getting where I'm coming from. It's not that hard to understand. That's the reason I'm saying, like, how many times we have to answer the same question, bro? If you have to love, that's not love. Love is a free decision of the human will and mind to care about somebody else's well-being.